Hey everybody, welcome back to Stone Mountain Barbecue. The camera's a little crooked, but that's okay because you can hear me and see me and that's all that really matters. Not really, but anyway, it's Monday weigh-in. Uh, this is week three. So three weeks on the carnivore diet. Fairly strict. Um, we'll talk about that in just a second, but first off, what y'all came to see and hear, we are down one whole pound. <laughs> So another week of just one pound of weight loss and um, you know it's still something it's still a loss it's still moving in the right direction I think that first week I was you know that I was so excited because I lost like nine pounds I think that was just my body flushing all the bad stuff out um, and so then that kind of made it a big boost in weight loss so today I was down to 368.0 which is exactly one pound from last week and I'm happy with it. I'm not frustrated like I was last week. Um, so yeah, just a pound, but it's still moving the right direction. Now, as far as an update of the overall three weeks, I got a little bit sick this week as far as keto flu, um, a couple of headaches. I felt pretty sluggish. Um, I felt like I was getting sick. Uh, so I don't know if you know I wasn't really hitting ketosis before and it really kicked in this week um, because I stopped cold turkey like carbs sugars all that stuff like I quit cold turkey I didn't you know transition into the diet like I woke up on Monday and was like this is what we're doing some people say that's not the best idea not the best way to do it but for me I had to do that had to make a decision and had to go for it um, as far as the way I feel, I feel pretty good today. Um, I fasted a lot last week, pretty much just eating once uh, a day. So pretty much like a 20, 21 to 22 hour fast. I might snack a little bit in between there as far as like on those carnivore crisps. If you haven't seen that video review, go check it out. It'll be in the iCard or somewhere. Just, you can, you can find it. Um, but other than that, I'm feeling pretty good. This is probably the longest I've ever stuck to a diet, an actual diet. Um, so I don't know. Breakfast today is going to be, well, it's going to be like lunch for me. But my first meal of the day is going to be uh, three little lamb chops and about four eggs scrambled. I've got it in my lunch box um, heading to my internship for school. Uh, it's about a 10-hour day roughly. And so... I eat about midday and then I don't eat again until I get home um, unless I just ain't hungry if I'm <laughs> ain't I'm a little southern um, in case you didn't know um, unless I'm not hungry then I don't eat uh, that's essentially what I've been trying to do or what I'm gonna try to do this week last week I just ate in the evenings I didn't eat in the morning I waited until I got home eight around seven o'clock and that was pretty much my meal for the day so that's where we are guys a three week update uh this video is going to be super quick super simple super easy um yeah so i'm still loving it i still love all the food still like what i'm doing um it's super simple it's super easy um as far as blood work things like that we're going to wait until after it'll probably be about three more weeks um, because I had blood work done before I started for some other stuff and I'd like to wait and then I have to get more blood work done in about three weeks for the same stuff to see how I'm doing and we're going to check and see what the numbers look like as far as my glucose and cholesterol and all that stuff so in a couple weeks we'll talk about that see what it shows but yeah that's where we're at guys three weeks into the carnivore diet still kicking still going pretty strong been uh stepping my butter game up trying to make sure i get those fats in definitely getting the proteins in and uh yeah so that's the update i appreciate you guys for watching thanks for sticking by me and 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 pushing me and keeping me in check and holding me accountable and doing all of that we're closing in on 7,000 subscribers we may hit it today i don't know if we do i thank you guys if we don't i thank you regardless so Y'all stick with me. We'll see what we can do. Thanks, guys. God bless.